Hi everyone, Sarah here. I just wanted to share some of my finished cards that I've been working on lately. I've been posting them on Instagram, but thought I would share them here on YouTube. And then I also have um, some new stamps to show you guys. So I'm going to start off with these ones. These were the backgrounds that I made with the Tim Holtz Distress Inks, uh, making the moons. So this one I colored up the little monster from your next stamp. And I just colored him in Copics, just in some purple tones, and added some glossy accents to his eyes and his teeth. So he's my little vampire monster. And I used this um, stamp from, it's from the CC Designs. I got this one last year, spooked out. Some good sayings on there for Halloween. So I just did the black embossing on top of the moon. And then to add it in so it wouldn't be so plain, I just added in some sequins. So these little tiny ones are the little three millimeter, I believe, from Pretty Pink Posh in Marshmallow. And then these ones are just from my dollar store, and those are from a local craft store, the black ones. So I did yellow, black, and white. Um, haven't done anything on the inside yet on these, but... So there's that one, and then this one. I love this one. This is the little zombie girl. <laughs> She's not actually a zombie girl. She's from the Greeting Farm Creeper Kit. I don't know if it's Creepy Crew 2 or Creeper Kit. It's from one of those ones. Um, I bought them and I haven't really used them very much. So when I decided I wanted to color up some zombies, I picked her instantly from the look on her face and her fancy dress. I thought she would be perfect little ghoul. So I used this Hey Ghoul Friend, and this is actually from the Monster stamp set from Your Next Stamp. And I did black embossing on there. And then I added the sequins, same ones in, but she is just adorable. I love how she turned out. So that's the second one. And then this one, I was coloring this guy and I was trying some different colors. He's from the same kit from the Greeting Farm. I was trying some different colors to try and get zombie looks. And I believe this one, um, it was more to look like a vampire, just like the pale with a little bit of purple in it. So I colored him up. The Your Fantastic is from the CC Design set. And then I just used some Halloween paper for my stash. I have a bunch of leftovers from last year. This is the Martha Stewart Derpy Goo that I punched out in red and just inked the edges and then used the little mini rhinestones from my dollar store. So cute. Love how it turned out. I did put some silver gel pen in his belt buckle. So those are the three cards that I got done so far just from Halloween stuff. Um, I did break down and put in an order at the Sweet Stamp Shop. They had another release for um, August. Yeah, it must have been August. And um, these are the only two new ones from the new release. They did a special this time. If you follow them on Facebook, they have like release parties on Facebook. And this release, she decided to do a special where she had um, a kit of all the brand new stamps. And there were some really cool ones in there. There was one with like the kale leaf and it said, you're kaling me. Stuff like that it was really funny. They have really, really funny stamps, but I, I'm supposed to be on a freeze, which obviously I suck at. So I'm really just going to stop saying that. I'm not going on a freeze anymore. I'm just going to try to spend less, which I'm doing good at. But I saw this stamp when she released it on Facebook and I love the saying, life takes you to unexpected places, love brings you home. Um, I did color one up. I used my Peerless watercolors and watercolor paper and then white embossing. So I embossed it and then colored on top of it. So super cute. I'm going to turn that into a card. So I love that saying. And then this one, um, sorry, I guess I could tell you. This one's called Love Life. And this one's called Encourage. So it's all encouraging words. So breathe, stay focused, relax, have faith, keep going. You, my friend, you've got this. Busy means polished, which is cool, and calm. So all very good words and sayings to use. And because I was ordering those, I decided to get some that I've wanted for a while but hadn't gotten. So this is um, 
Superboy and then Girl Power. So it's got the regular little boy with the glasses and then it's got the Superboy all dressed up. And then all the sayings. So you're my super superhero minus the spandex. You and spandex scares me, which would be awesome for my husband. The glasses don't fool me. Superhero. The time is always right to do what's right. And then the girl power one has the little girl with the glasses, which these would work good for back to school too. Little nerdy girl and boy. And then the superhero. And then her sayings are, hiya, every girl has a cape, mine's pink with glitter, pow, bam, and girl power. So a lot of them are interchangeable between the boys and girls, but or any superheroes. And then I picked up this alphabet, and it's outline lower alpha perfect to put together to just make a word on a card so I've seen a lot of people use these so that was the sweet stamp shop and then my super secret stamp club showed up today yay now because I'm in Canada I get all three at the same time um, everyone else gets one a month but I have to wait till the end of the second month to get mine so this is um, July August and September yeah, because then there's October, November, December, so only one more left in the in the year. And I do not have all of them because I didn't sign up at the beginning, so there's some of the fairy tale ones that I don't have, so I'm not sure if I'm going to go back and get them. Okay, so this is number 19. This is Ezra. So adorable with this Polaroid camera. As soon as I saw people posting pictures of it, I was so happy. Because you're always worried what you're going to get, right? But totally worth it. And then Evie, she is so cute. She's holding a cup of coffee. She's got her toque on. Sorry about the glare, guys. Her ponytail. Um, the only thing I think is I might stamp without the face and the heart. She looks a little, uh, I don't know, wild child to have a heart on her hat, but we'll see. It's adorable, though. And then Blair. Look at her. She is so cute. She has her big hat on, her glasses, and then her little dress with little rose on it. It's so adorable. So I got these all laminated and ready to go together because I have my basket here of all my greeting farm stamps. This is how I store them so that they're all out here on their cards. These are all the secret stamp ones on this side and these are all other ones. So. Um, keep an eye out because the registration or s subscription for the next club is coming up soon. Alright, so leave a comment, subscribe if you wish, and have a great day. Thanks, bye!